During the Salem witch trials, many men and women were murdered for their crimes. But one above all else was persecuted to the fullest extent of the law. Her name was Bridget Bishop. You see, the other witches believed that after she was killed, she would come back as a gift to them to protect them. From that day forward, they only referred to her as the given. Salem witch trials were basically the persecution of lots of different people that they believed were witches. Now these were men, women, children, they killed whoever they needed to kill to protect themselves. But there was one person who I found particularly interesting and it was this lady here. Her name is Bridget Bishop. Now she was sort of the uh, queen of the witches if you will. Supposedly uh, she was the one that was going to come back and save all the other witches. So when she died they believed that she would come back from the dead and they used to call her the given, the given one, the one that was given to them. And they used to call the people that like stopped going with her angels, the people that went with her devils. Um, and everyone was a follower of the given. But we're going to see how you would have done in the Salem Witch Trials. So here I've got some names. These cards have the people that were actually involved in the Salem Witch Trials. Now Mary Black was deemed an angel. She was a survivor. We have Sarah Bassett, who was deemed to be a devil. She was killed. But I want you to make some decisions. I want you to decide who dies and who lives, who was an angel, who was a devil. So here we have two names. Now one of these was found to be an angel. We have uh, Daniel Andrew and we have Andrew Carrier. Which one was an angel? Daniel Andrew. Daniel Andrew was an angel. Now, up until this point, you've been deciding the fate of one person each time. From this point on, you're going to decide the fate of two people. Okay. You're going to kill one and allow one to survive. Okay. So here we have John Alder and Sarah Buckley. One was found to be an angel, one a devil. Which one was the angel? Um, John. John was the angel. Mm -hmm. That means you've just killed Sarah. Sorry, Sarah. <laughs> so you should be. We've got Hannah. And we've got William. One was an angel. Which one was the angel? Um, Hannah. Hannah was the angel. That means you just killed William. Yeah. Now I want you to think about this for a second. There was no particular reason that you put these cards into this pile, correct? Mm -hmm. And for example, uh, in this pile we've got uh, Sarah. Was there a particular reason that you put her in the devil pile? No. And you didn't feel controlled by anyone to do that? Not that I'm aware of, no. Now there's something that I didn't tell you. On the back of these cards there are some letters. Now this pile was our angel pile that you put these into. And these letters just so happen to spell something out. That's A, N, G, E and L. These are our angels. <laughs> you put these cards into this pile. That's D, E, V, I, L. And it just so happens that perhaps this evening, Jenny, you've yeah. been controlled by Bridget Bishop the one they knew as Given. the Given. That's very good. I've done that. You did do that. <laughs>